their chance to tell the nation their accomplishments. On Friday, China's Chief Justice and Procurator General delivered their work reports to the NPC deputies. Chief Justice Zhou Qiang said between 2013 and 2017, the Supreme People's Court was able to wrap up the vast majority of the 82,000 cases it handled. He said the intellectual property law has been enhanced and judicial reform further improved. Zhou added that about 13,000 people were convicted for bribery and 39 major wrongful judgments were rectified. The Supreme People's Court has resolutely implemented the decisions of the CPC Central Committee. 18 reformulated tasks led by the Supreme People's Court have been completed. 65 measures to comprehensively deepen reform of the People's Courts have been fully implemented. There has been important progress in the judicial reform of the People's Court. Procurator General Cao Jianmin, meanwhile, prioritized the building of a safer China. He said authorities approved the arrest of over 4.5 million suspected criminals and prosecuted around 7 million over the past five years. Since October 2014, 222 fugitives implicated in duty-related crimes have been repatriated or persuaded to return to China from 42 countries and regions. Among them, 35 were listed in an Interpol red notice. Cooperation with other countries was also enhanced. In 2017, China successfully hosted the 22nd International Conference of Prosecutors. The Supreme People's Prerogatorate has signed 145 bilateral agreements with judicial institutions in 95 countries and regions. We put emphasis on investigating major and prominent cases. Over 250,000 duty crimes were registered, an increase of 16.4 percent compared to the past five years. Over 55 billion yuan in losses have been recovered. Among them, there are 15,234 officials at the county and division level and 2,405 officials at the bureau level. Under the unified leadership of the party central committee, since the 18th National Congress, procuratorial institutions have investigated 120 former officials at or above the provincial or ministerial level and prosecuted 105 former officials at the same level. We've seen that the country has emphasized the importance of the rule of law, particularly after the 19th CPC National Congress. Significant progress has been made. I think over the past few years, our judicial system reform has made progress at the grassroots level. We've seen the notable reform to limit the quota of judges to help them in making impartial and sound judgments. Great achievements have been made over the past five years in advancing the reform of the country's judicial system as it's crucial to the country's rule of law and the entire governance system. Chief Justice and Procurator General said more efforts will be made in promoting social fairness and justice to safeguard the well-being of the people. Su Yuting, CGTN, Beijing.